So I'm going to show you how I pass sound from Ableton straight into a software called Loopback and then Loopback into a Google Meets so that someone on the receiving end can receive the Ableton sound. So let's start off with the settings on Ableton. So Ableton, you have to make sure that your output device is not loopback. So it can be any other audio hardware device. Um, so I've got an audio interface called the DL16S uh, and that's selected. And I've just got two samples playing over here. And now when I go into loopback, you can add sources here into where you want the sound to come in from. And I've got my Ableton on, I've got my Brave browser on, I've got sound coming out of my audio interface here. And now if I look here on the right, it says it's only coming out through the left ear. So I'm going to actually take this and also put it into the right channel. So we get a more of a stereo signal rather than a mono signal. So it doesn't come out of only one ear. And then the pass through is on now there's one more important thing you got to do you open the options and you deselect mute when capturing and then in the monitor section over here this is where you can hear yourself from a device so if i wanted to hear myself off of my laptop speakers i could just turn this on and it comes out of there um so that's the uh, settings and loopback and then over here, let's have a look at the browser. And I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna go to settings. Now, there's a very important setting in the browser that you need to turn off, which is the noise cancellation. Your input needs to be the loopback. And then the speakers can be whatever it is, but the input is where the one you wanna select is loopback. Um, with the, I tried with this on, and the sound wasn't transmitting but once this is turned off i was able to transmit sound so i'm going to just press play here and the sound is coming out and just to test it i've got a second machine on my right side over here i've got i've got another machine uh, i'm just gonna increase the volume of the right side of my machine and you'll be able to hear the Ableton sounds coming out and so is my voice from my mic. That's how I get sound from Ableton into a chat software like Google Meets. Have a great day, subscribe to the channel and make some awesome music.